Hello, I'm Daniel Brown and welcome to another Wolves vlog. We had the disappointment of last week losing in the semi-final, but this week we've forgotten about that. And we're in Southampton and it's not bad weather. Uh, the blue sky and the clouds are out. And we're going to go to the marina later to see the sea. But for now it's Southampton against Wolves. Joined by Luke, as usual. What's your score prediction for today? Um, what? So I've had to be quite good recently. Mm. Especially at home. They've uh, definitely improved under the new manager. They're definitely going to stay up. Um, I think it's going to be a tough game. I, I just hope the players, their minds still aren't on last Sunday. My mind's not on last Sunday at all. Yeah, but it, it's such a heartbreak that it, it could happen, couldn't it? It could. Um, but if we, if we, if the fans are not in that mindset, That's then the players yeah. won't be either. Yeah, I mean, we've had bad results, I mean, bad performances, and then we've always come back good. But it obviously yeah. feels different, because obviously it's an FA Cup semi final, and you've got 2 0 up there. Um, so what's your score predict? 2 0 out. <laughs> oh, come on. In fact, we always lose 2 0. Well, we don't. Did we? All, we did a few years ago. James Ward process. Been fantastic, right? But we're not interested in him. <laughs> um, I'm going to say 2 1 to Wolves with a Andy Keogh header and a Richard Stearman header as well, which is what happened in 2009. Yeah, what? Eight. We've kind of upgraded since then. Yeah, so Instead it's going to be Keogh, two other players. Yeah. So we'll see you in the River Riverside Stadium of Southampton, not Middlesbrough. <laughs> the Southampton ground.
Chelsea to do in the second half is defend. Jump. <laughs> Just like Billy Bullard yes, did for his goal. If you can do it a couple more times, then we'll be very happy. Who wants to buy for that? Great time at the game. Thank you. 